Hello, everybody. Welcome to edition of Mr. E Says. Before I get started, man, I want to congratulate my UTEP miners, baby. They did what I said. All right? They whipped some fucking ass. You know, not like exactly like I said, but they did it. They pulled it off, man. 24 to 14. I'm not going to lie. They gave me a heart attack in a moment. It was 14 to 3. Grabbed myself a cold fucking beer. I'm telling my girl, here we go again. But uh, little by little, they came back. You know, it looks like we got a new quarterback in town. Gavin Hardison. I'm glad, you know, it's, it's one quarterback and not a two quarterback system. Let the quarterback get adjusted. Let the quarterback play his fucking game. It looks like the rise of a local high school football legend is making it in collegiate football. You know, I'm talking about Hankins. He's a fucking monster, man. He's big, bro. That motherfucker must have gained like 30 pounds of fucking muscle. He looks like a fucking Mack truck. But let's take it. And we got to admit, we were playing Stephen F. Austin. Little Stephen F. Austin. They came down, man, you know, and they gave it their all. They thought, you know what, man, we're going to fuck these guys up, man. Fuck these motherfuckers. Who the fuck they think they are? Nah, UTEP did their thing, bro. They did their fucking thing. You know, a little moment they had, you know, the moment, you know, that unity, that was, that was a beautiful thing. Very beautiful thing. You know, both teams, you know, there was no, no penalty or anything like that. That was a very nice thing. But, you know, we fucked you up, so that's it. You know, but anyway... You know what, man? This is the thing, okay? Um, I want, I'm not going to talk about Texas today. You know, that would be, that would be during the week, the Battle of Texas, you know? But right now, I want to talk about my experience in this social distanced Sun Bowl. All right, you know what? I don't know who the fuck comes up with the ideas, okay? But this is the thing. You got a stadium of 50,000 motherfuckers, right? 50, I'm not a stadium, but yeah, a stadium that seats 50,000 fuckers. You got 6,000 people in the stands. You would think everybody, okay, would be distanced. But fuck no, it wasn't. It wasn't. It looked like a fucking Mexican piñata party, right? That's how it was. Clusters here, clusters there, clusters fucking everywhere, man. You know, I want to thank Cap, man. Cap hooked me up with some tickets. I appreciate it, brother. Got me on the 50. But I went down to my seats. There was a couple to the left and a couple to the right of me. So I had to make a move and I had to move, man. But you know what? I didn't feel safe. I have my mask on at all times. Not everybody had their mask on at all times. There was a guy going back and forth through the, the sideline looking to make sure everybody had their mask on. Put your mask on, motherfucker. But you know what? This is the thing. They need to move, motherfuckers. Don't worry about the fucking mask, bitch. Move, motherfuckers, with their fucking distance. Social distance, bitch. That was one gripe. Another gripe is when we rolled up. We roll up to the fucking stadium. Okay. There's parking B and parking A and parking C and parking I don't give a fuck. You know, all those fucking lots. You know the lots? With the motherfucker that's getting paid seven fifty dollars a fucking hour. You can't park here, sir. You can't park here. Yeah, fuck you, bro. This is the problem. Okay? You can let people park anywhere they want and you should because they came down to see the product, you bitch. That's the way it should be. But no, you just got to make their money, man. Let those fucking parking lots be empty. Make those people fucking walk their fucking ass off. Make your abuelita walk. Make that motherfucking... Those fucking... That sucks, bro. It's not cool. It's not cool. It's not cool by UTEP doing that shit to people. It's not cool when the beer's so fucking expensive. You know what? There was one thing that was cool. And I like this, okay? This is really cool. When I went to the restroom, you can only be nine allowed in the restroom. All right? Only nine! So, you know, they had one urinal and the one you couldn't use and one urinal and you couldn't use, one stall, one stall you couldn't use. And I kind of like that. Usually when you're taking a piss with some creepy nine-year-old man, oh, nice dick, motherfucker. No, for real. It's scary in there, man. You don't know. Mr. E is afraid of that shit. There's a bunch of perverts up in that bitch. So it was nice. So, you know, this is my thing, okay? This is the fucking thing. Is UTEP... He's coming together. It looks like a pretty good squad. I think they're going to be fine this year. I hope the guys are healthy for next week's game. And the main thing is I hope the fans are healthy for next week's game. Because this is the thing. This is my main gripe. At the end of the night, when UTEP won, and there's people in the tunnel yelling, Yeah, motherfucker, we're back, man. Yeah, dude, we're fucking back. UTEP 2000, bitch, in the fucking house. Bro, we just beat Stephen F. Austin. Shut the fuck up. But you know, I understand your excitement. This is your excitement. That we're 1-0, baby. We didn't have to wait for a win at the end of the year. We're 1-0. Let's get it going. But this is my main fucking gripe with UTEP at the end of the night. 
after we won and people are exiting, going in through that tunnel, all 6,000 motherfuckers all close together, almost holding fucking hands and making out during the pandemic, right? But you're also worried about us, aren't you? No, you're not, you dumb motherfuckers. Because if you were, you would have said, hey, you know what? A few here, a few there. A few here, a few there. Distance it, but you didn't do that. So people might get sick now because you're stupid and you're dumb fucks. That's pretty much all you got. Besides that, you know, fuck that. Fuck the way they handle certain things. So hopefully for the next game, when we play fucking another fucking team from fucking high school ranks, and we whip their ass too on September 19th, hopefully you get it right. That's pretty much all I got, guys. UTEP is fucking back. Watch for my show during the week. UTEP versus Texas in the Texas showdown. The king of Texas, bitch. That's pretty much all I got. I'm out, baby.